Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be reviewing the brand new cavity palette from Jeffree Star and the Blood Sugar Mini. So I just got this from Beautylish. I'm going to say I'm a little bit disappointed in the packaging because we all know that he has some of the best packaging out there. But if you guys notice, like, where is it here? Like, I don't know. It's like, feels like it's missing some like right here. It's missing. And it looks like there's, I don't know if it's supposed to look that way. Do you, I don't know if you guys can see that like debris in the there, but okay. So I just want to open this up and show you guys. So there it is right there. So I don't know, like, is it better to order right from his website? I mean, like, I know the shipping there is really slow, so I went with um, Beautylish. So there's the colors right there. I'm going to swatch them um, in a bit. I'm going to put some on my eyes. I haven't done my eye makeup. And then I had to get this. As soon as I saw this, I was like, yeah, I have to get it. Um, there's the outside of it. That's the back of it. There it is there. Guys, look how beautiful this is. So let's take that off. That pink is just killing me. And then it, he said rose gold and I'm like, yep, I'm done. So I know frozen prick might be a hard one to use, but I will figure that out. There you guys go. Oh, sorry. Go. Those are the colors there. So we're going to like put those on as well. So I want to start with this one here. Now, if you guys don't know, the mini um, palette actually comes with all the outside shades are available in the Blood Sugar um, palette. This shade is the only new shade. Um, he did this because so many people had said that the it was hard to travel with this. And I do agree. Um, and I did get it, and I, I know a lot of people are like, well, if you have the other one, you don't need it. And I completely agree, except for the fact that I do like that. Those are some of my favorite shades in this. Um, so there's the that. Now you can get the um, Anniversary Edition in... Um, Yes, yeah, Candy Floss is one of my favorite ones. The Glucose I've used. Sugar Cane I've definitely used. Sweetener I have used. Now this sweetener looks different than this sweetener. Huh. And the Cherry Soda. Now it might be just the age of it. Um... Yeah, I don't know. Okay, so I'm going to get started with a look with... Um, the mini palette and then what I'll do is I'll do swatches you know um, one side will be the um, the new version and then the old version um, I did not pick up the lip set because it was way out of my price range so I am okay so I am gonna go in with glucose here it's just this white shade it's such a great starting shade and it'll just go all over. There is, of course, fallout with that white shade, but. Alright, we are heading into another storm. I think my Ipsy is in, but I haven't gotten it yet. I went earlier today. Um, I am going to be drawing the name tonight, and I will get a hold of that person, and I will announce that tomorrow. Um, I was going to draw it yesterday, but then I realized, like, you know, yesterday should just kind of keep it open. So I'll do that now. Or today, anyway, tonight. Okay. So I'm just going to... So I am going to go in with the... I think I'm going to go in with cherry soda, and I'm going to take... beautiful red I 
I'm going in very, very light. If you guys notice, you don't need to put a whole lot on. I do have a lot on my brush, but. And I'll clean this up after, so. Okay, so I am gonna go in with a, again, another shade. Uh, this one is gonna be more defined. I am gonna go in with Coma. Just evenly coat the brush. I'm gonna go in with my Gerard Cosmetics. Okay, sorry about that. So, um, I am going to put on the color. Um, I'm gonna go in with sweetener here. Just. I'm going to use this one. Yes. Hey, Mom. All right. Now I'm going to go in with this color cavity. And I know I'm not using the right brush, but that's just, I just want to see how this goes on with a brush. So let's go under and then I'll finish this eye look for you guys. So I am going to go under with, um, I think I'm going to go under with Prick. And with, so I'm going to go in with this angle one. I'm going to go in with Sugar Cane. Okay guys, so let's play with this. Just to let you guys know, didn't do anything more or anything less. I just, I used the colors. I just cleaned it up a little bit, added a little more, more under the eyes. I added my mascara. Um, I'm really, really thrilled with this look. Like, yeah. Okay, so I am gonna put on, I think I'm gonna go with the rose gold. I just wanna see what this is like. So I did do, That might be just a little too big. I'm gonna go in with one of these here. So I did go in. Oh. Look at that. So um, I did do the hourglass. contouring okay um, I'm going to go in actually with this candy frost here just oh he's so beautiful so I'm using it as like a blush topper 
It is absolutely beautiful. Look at that, guys. The other side, I'm going to go with icing. I'm just going to... Let's do this with the icing. That is gorgeous. Can you guys see that? No, I got this. I will be using this candy frost forever, I swear. Okay, so I don't really have any place to put this last color, and this is Frozen Prick. So I, I'm just going to see what it looks like right here. I'm like all glitted up. Hmm. Okay, guys, there is part of the look. I'm just going to finish off with a lip. So I'm just going to throw these in. Okay. So I'm going to pick up something from here. Now, I did not get the new one. So it has, the new one has this in it. So I think I'm going to go with, um, I don't know. Wifey just seems to. Ooh. So I think I might actually go in with doll parts. I'm going to go in with doll parts, and I know I have this as a lip liner. And it's more of a purple, but. Okay. Okay, guys. Okay, guys, I just went through uh, the gloss on, and I used Control Freak. Um, kind of brightens it up a little bit. I really, really do like that. Um, okay, so let's, let's do these swatches and see if there's a difference in pigments or colors or anything like that. I'm just going to roll that back. Okay, so the first one... I'm just going to get some of these. So, my hands are completely clean here. Okay, so I'm going to go in with glucose. So, this will be the new side, this will be the old side. Okay. So sugar cane. Okay, so there's definitely a feeling difference. I don't know if you guys can see that. So, um, so, ouch. So these ones feel more. definitely feel a lot different. They feel more velvety. Okay, so candy floss, candy floss. Okay, so they do look different right there. So this is the new candy floss. This is the old one. Do you guys see a difference there? This one looks more shiny. You can definitely tell it's a, a more velvety. It feels more velvety. Okay. So I'm not going to. So actually here. Put Wisdom. Wisdom does not actually feel velvety in this. Oh, it's such a beautiful swatch. Did you see that? Okay. So let's go in with um, Sweetener. So new. I don't think I did that one as much. Okay. 
these almost look the same. Okay, so. I'm running out of arm spots, so let's do this. So those are the three. Okay. So that's prick cherry soda in coma. So prick cherry soda and coma. So So prick definitely looks different, does it not? So prick I'm going to try prick again. Okay. <laughs> kind of like stain. It's staining my fingers, guys. <laughs> so. Okay, so there's prick. So I definitely see a difference. Okay. All right, guys, go. Um, that's just crazy. Uh, yeah. So if you do have the old one, I think the formula on this one is a lot better. I'm not going to sit here and, and lie. Do you need it? Absolutely. And equivalently not if you already have this one shade is not worth the extra $38 Canadian. I think I paid for it. But if you like his stuff and want something that you can tack away and not worrying about breaking all of the shades in case something happens, I would definitely go for this. If you are just collecting all of his palettes, definitely grab it. But do you need it? Absolutely not. I will say I will be using um, this quite a bit. I do love the colors, just like the mini uh, Jawbreaker is just absolutely gorgeous. Um, I'm glad I got this. As for this, I think this is fun. I really do. I, I like the the packaging to this, like it is raised. I don't know if you guys can see that. It is raised, it's sturdy cardboard. Um, yeah, so the packaging on this is just superb. Same as this. Um, now I did not get the white version, obviously. I just don't have the money for it, so yeah. But anyway, guys, I hope you really enjoyed this video. I know that there's a lot of drama and controversy sur surrounding him, but that's not the place for, for it here in this video. I'm just here to try his makeup. Um, and honestly, I think this look is definitely a hit for me. I really do enjoy it. And I'm going to take lots of pictures of it because I just want to crawl on my couch. <laughs> Okay, guys, watch out for the video um, uh, where I announce my winner. I'm going to go do that off camera. I will, like, um, I'll record this the screenshot of it only because I have to verify that the winner is still subscribed because I've had people subscribe and then not subscribe in the last month. So I just want to make sure of that. So, um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you guys have a great day. And please don't forget to give this video a like, maybe a share, and make sure you're subscribed.